Hello, good evening and welcome to the Rumour Mill News. Here is your latest bulletin. While Norwich City filled their number 10 shirt with Leroy Fair in the United States on Saturday, don't be fooled, they still want strikers. Two of them, we understand. And the current hit list is three long. Juventus have reportedly turned down City's £6 million advances for Fabio Quagliarella, although it's suggested on the continent that another £1.5 million would be enough to make him a City man. That would only then leave the small matter of convincing Fabio himself to switch from Juve to Yella. Not simples. City may have a plan B in store already. Rumours that City fancy taking a punt on Maxi Lopez have been around for a week or so, and now they've had numbers added to them. Numbers like three-year deal and £3.5 million fee, and although less palatable for some, might be 29, as in years, and five, as in the number of goals he scored last season while on loan at Sampdoria. Still, the guy has a group of Argentine fans that have set up their own church to follow and worship the ex Barca man who is supposed to revolutionise football. So let's hope the parish exists to exult at his football skills rather than following his blonde locks. Third on the list is going to come as a complete surprise. Definitely. Or not. The best news is this is the week we find out about Gary Hooper's future. No, really. Neil Lennon said it himself or at least he did last week, uh, be it pocketing a few quid for the privilege of trips to Bournemouth and Yeovil for QPR, harnessing the earth-shattering power provided by the natural combination of yellow and green, or presumably rocking back and forth, trying to take satisfaction from avoiding another Neil Lennon clip round the year by staying at Celtic. Would that mean that George Samaras is available? The Mirror are also pushing City's interest in striker Demay Ndoy. Apparently, locomotive Moscow are being difficult, although I'm not sure if that means refusing to answer the phone or maybe pretending they can't speak English. Uh, with City in the USA until the end of the week, it's been a little quieter than normal on the rumour front. But one thing we do know, officially, is that Leon Barnett is free to find a new club. Left at home as City headed stateside, Chris Hewton confirmed the 27-year-old shouldn't hang around in Norfolk if he actually wants to play some football next season. Harsh or not, Leon will be hoping the coming campaign isn't his last with City, rather the first with someone else. Anyone else? I mean, where are Cardiff when you need them, eh? And that's it. Quiet. And let's hope that's only a temporary situation. After all, we've still got 42 days until the transfer window closes and just 26 days until the start of the Premier League season. Finally, don't forget to catch our own summer style icon Paddy Davitt out in the US. He's following Norwich City's pre-season tour and providing some top video and news lines, both in terms of the Canaries and the latest LA fashion trends. Not many people can carry off a pair of aviators and a swimming pool like that. OK, we're done here, but before I go, here's a quote from basketball great Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. You can't win unless you learn how to lose. So that's at least one preseason box Norwich City can tick. Until next time, guys and girls, goodbye.